All right. So our first one, it's, it's again, Hallmark movie or romance novel. I'll give you a title. You tell me which one it is. Each, I forgot my notebook. I'll have to write this down on my phone. Each one will be 10 points. And if you steal, I'll give you five. Okay. Hey. So the name is In a Holidays. In a Holidays. And I see John looking at his phone trying to look things up. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm not looking things up. I'm not. That's not that like trashy dad. porn. Go ahead, Dad. What is it? Is it a romance novel or a homework movie? It's a homework movie. <laughs> that would be incorrect. <laughs> it's it's not actually like a porn. Of course, it's a trashy romance novel. It's a romance novel by Christian Lauren. And, and ironically, it's not as trashy as you think. It actually has to do with like a um. It's actually really good. It has to do with like time travel and everything else. Actually, was really time good. travel. Oh, the, guy, come the, on. the girl got into like a time loop and all this kind of stuff. It was a crazy book. I'm not oh, gonna lie. I would. I would have guessed a movie. I'll be honest. So. <laughs> all right. Well, I'll I'll throw this one to Sal because it's more fun. One royal holiday, Hallmark movie, a romance novel. Oh, that's easy. What is it? It's a Hallmark movie. You're absolutely right. Because and it that... sounds like a Hallmark movie. <laughs> well, not even that. We actually just watched this the other day. He made you watch this the other day. <laughs> and the reason we watch it is because Bradley Rose from Peloton's in the movie. <laughs> there you go. Did anyone die? No, but it was it was it was sweet. It wasn't anything over the top. I wouldn't say amazing movie, but it was sweet. It was cute. The funny part was um I I, I don't know, it's, um Aaron Aaron Turbet, who is a big Broadway person, he plays the prince that gets caught in a in a small town in, in Massachusetts. <laughs> and then, yeah. Exactly. Uh, um, and where is he from? Is he from England? Yes. Yeah. Is from, I forgot the name of the, I don't have the name of the country. They made up a country, obviously. It's not a real country. It was not a real country. And one of the biggest castles I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. <laughs> ever. I mean, they just better castles on Disney Channel. <laughs> so <for> this movie, <laughs> There's plenty of real ones. Just go and film it, it there. But that would take bad. money, I suppose. It was hysterically <laughs> bad. It was hysterically bad. All right, uh, John. This is a, it should be an easy one, but I don't know what you guys. Um, let's go with the holiday swap. <laughs> See, now to me that sounds like a movie, but we've had a movie last. I, I, screw it. I'm gonna no, say you're it's thinking a of sister movie. swap or whatever that movie was called. <laughs> <laughs> what was that, John? I'm gonna say a Hallmark movie. Wrong. It would be a book. Oh. <laughs> it sounds like a cheap porn. What's funny is it's sitting, it's sitting, in, it's sitting on the shelf in the living room. That's why I pop it on. Uh, it's it's it. It it sounds like a children, movie to me. Blake. Was that? You have children living in that house, Blake. <laughs> oh yeah, because a teenager would give this shit about a. Let's get boy. it on. Oh yeah. yeah. Everybody knows that the kids are always out there trying to steal romance novels. So you've, got to, you've got to put them under lock and key. You know what? If there's one thing in this house that's really good, it's hiding things in plain sight. Really good this house. Like, I don't know. Do you remember when Fifty Shades of Grey first came out? And how all the rage and people want to get the book because there was a lot of... Uh, Promiscuous things in you the book. I, I will say oh. something. I did see all those movies, and they're all fucking terrible. Yeah. <laughs> but the, book is, the books are supposed to be so much better. I don't know. Even I never read the fans books. of the books hate the movies. I haven't heard a single person. Say I think the like only the movie, movie that was somewhat decent was the third one. That's the only one that was somewhat decent. <laughs> <laughs> ay, ay, ay. All right, um, Dad. The yeah. naughty list. <laughs> this this <laughs> could go either way. Exactly. That's why I put it here. Uh I'm gonna say Hallmark movie. Wrong again. Oh. <laughs> it sounds like a porno. Come on. <laughs> I feel like this is the name of the episode, but that would be really get the wrong audience in this episode. <laughs> hey, is Santa is is that a list in your pocket or you just happen to see me? The naughty list is actually it's a really, 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 really naughty romance novel. I read it in an ebook last year. Oh. <laughs> Extremely naughty. Like that was crazy bad. Well, we all want Santa's candy cane. So you know, it was a, oh, it was my. also a girl on girl story. It was girl on girl. Oh, story. oh. oh. Santa oh, was hello. a female. Then, Santa then, was a female in the story. Then, then Mrs. Claus is hiding something. No, no, Santa was a female. <laughs> Santa was a female. So there you go. Santa <laughs> was a female. Yeah, in the story. <laughs> Okay. All right, so did she have it. a beard? No. <laughs> not a real one. Then I'm not interested. Sal. <laughs> Sal, I'll go to you. See if you get this one. It is called A Very Bossy Christmas. Okay. 
Uh, that is definitely a Hallmark movie. You're absolutely wrong. <laughs> what? <laughs> But it doesn't sound like a porno. <laughs> it is a Cali Lurie book that came out last year. <laughs> last year. It was actually, she did a whole like holiday theme thing to the Valentine's book and a Christmas book. And like, <laughs> so. A very bossy Christmas. Yes. It's uh, pretty much it's a book about the fact that um, the, her, it's, the executive assistant had, this, had a crush on her boss. and But her boss treats her like shit. But they ended up having sex in a hotel on the road. <laughs> Perfectly normal. Perfectly well, normal. well, at least it wasn't in do. the conference room on the conference table. Oh my God! Stop. As you do. <laughs> All right, um, John. The Christmas, the, the Christmas contest. The <laughs> Christmas contest. Okay, I'm going with Sal's logic then. It doesn't sound like a porno, <laughs> so it's a Hallmark movie. You're absolutely right, actually. <laughs> and not only the current movie, yeah, it, it actually starred Cameron Cameron Bure. <laughs> what? Whoa! It just came out. And actually, the only reason we I even know this exists, I saw DJ, it. DJ Tanner. Well, the funny part is we do we do we already we haven't watched it yet because it's Cameron Cameron Bure and Josh Bor- Broken from Fuller House. They were both in Fuller House together. <laughs> That's why we DVR'd it. Hmm. <laughs> it is sitting on our DVR. Oh. We're gonna watch it probably next weekend. It's <laughs> okay. So, all right. Uh, where was I here? Okay, what's going on? To um back to dad, a Uh-oh. Christmas dance reunion. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go book. You know, I, I, I was hoping you would actually take this. It would have tied up the score, but you got it wrong. It would be a Hallmark <laughs> movie. It just came <laughs> out. I have not seen it, but I know who's in it, and it's Corbin Blue and Morty Coleman from High School Musical. What? Cor- <laughs> what? <laughs> Not a, joke. Not a joke. Not a joke. Maybe well, can't still linger on. I did the fact that they did a movie together now. It's just so funny to me. So, all right, Sal. There's something yeah. about Mary. M-E-R-R-Y. Something about Mary. Okay, that has to be a Hallmark movie. It has to be a romance novel. I told you all. Hey, Sal, <laughs> think of your logic. It's... That doesn't sound like a porno. <laughs> If, there was, it, if the movie, if it was called There's Something in Mary, then yes, then that's porno. <laughs> Maybe that's why Mary is Mary. There what's, you funny go. About it, what's funny about it, I love the fact that it's called that because I, I, I said that one and Andy looked at me like, isn't that a movie? But I'm like, no, that's something about Mary, not something about Mary. It's two different <laughs> things. <laughs> two different things. All right. Um, this is the one that threw Mandy, just to warn you. This is the one that actually Mandy got wrong when I did this game with her. Okay. So I wanted to see how difficult it was. And I'll give it to John. It is called a novel romance. <laughs> well, logic would say it's a book, but it's. But then that makes me want to say it's a movie. But then maybe that's the trick. <laughs> maybe it is a book, which is so obvious you would never suspect. So I'm going. I'm going to say a Hallmark movie. You are correct. Yeah. <laughs> wow. And you know what? That Mandy got that one wrong because she never heard of it. I, it literally, it. I never heard of this. I literally was looking for one. I, I, one, I, only ran, I only had so many. I wanted to get 10 titles and I just needed an extra one. Okay. So I went on the Hallmark website and I grabbed this one off the Okay, website. so my thing is, my thing is, is it a Hallmark movie about a book? Um, it's a, it's a best-selling romance novelist moves to Portland to cure her writer's block. Ah, <laughs> so well, here's the thing. Here's the thing. It could have gone either way. Yeah. By the way, it unknowingly falls in love with her biggest critic. <laughs> because, of course. Wow. <laughs> what else would you do in Portland? <laughs> Hilarity and shoes. I'm uh, sure. Let's see. Uh... Okay. And our last one. I'll go to dad with this one. And um, he is not on the board yet. So we'll see what happens here. <laughs> Yay! It is a Royal Queen's Christmas. A Royal what? Royal Queen's Christmas. Oh, I heard something else. <laughs> so did I. I was uh, questioning what was happening. I, I, I think the word that Sally had begins with a C and ends with an M. Wait, is this a, is this a RuPaul production? <laughs> well, that would give it away now, wouldn't it? <laughs> I'd give it away. Uh... I'm going to go Hallmark movie. And you finally got one on the board. Hey. <laughs> on the board. 
Um, by the way, another one I never heard of this. I literally found it on the website. It was a prince finds his way to his finds his way to Queens during Christmas, and when a local woman enlists his help with a Christmas a children's Christmas show. <laughs> what? Why are so many of these about princes? <laughs> what was the meme? I said to Mandy the other day. I have to find out what happened. It was a very funny meme I sent her about Hallmark movies. That made wait me wait you're, you're, you're talking about the Queen Mum? No, not the Queen Mum. Okay. Here it is. Basically, Homework has made 437 Christmas movies with 17 actors, five locations, and three different plots. <laughs> <laughs> Did you three say plots? 437? And you know what? I think it might be exaggerated, but it might also might not be. I don't know. I only watched one this year. <laughs> oh, this is the first year I actually watched one. Uh, one uh, of them, two of the three you know, <laughs> you know, when the Christmas season starts, there are actually parties that to get together to watch the Hallmark movie marathon. Yeah, that's called, yeah. Twitter. That's called Twitter. That's called Twitter. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, that's called COVID. No, that, oh, well, yeah. no I know someone on, I'll, I'll shout her out, Lizzie, our, our, our friend of the show, Lizzie, at, Liz, at Lizzie T. She actually live tweets Hallmark movies all month long. <laughs> <laughs> Even when she was on vacation in New York City, she was still live tweeting. Hummer movies on her Twitter account. Dedication. Oh, <laughs> so, all right, that, is that game. And according to the scoreboard, that means um, John, John's in the lead. Way. Yay. Um, Yay. And Sal and Dad have 10 points, but John has 20 points. He only got two right. But hey, it worked because the other one only got one right. <laughs> hey, and you know what? Still a lead. And, so, and I so. I I, 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 that went as well as I expected it to. That went just as well as I thought it was going to go. 